I'll probably still get oh. sample. Mm, no. uh, what? Hello. Hi. 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 Oh my gosh, let me see your eyeliner. I feel like we do this every time. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Mm. We're drinking. We're drinking. We're drinking. Violet. Violet bubbly. Oh, I love that name. Violet Bubbly. Violet Bubbly. We're drinking Violet Bubbly. Violet Bubbly. Cheers. Cheers. Mine's like almost gone. I got a flower. We made a recipe, or we made a, what video. did we make? We made a recipe. We did make a recipe. And then we made a video With. of us making the recipe. I've been really excited for this one. We're like, we've had this Violet Syrup for a few weeks and haven't used it yet. Except I did have iced tea lemonade with violet syrup in it and then I just wanted to drink the whole bottle. Video, recipe, non-alcoholic. Okay, non Link down below. This, this one's alcoholic. Okay, you know how people have so much advice for us? Uh-huh. On our YouTube channel, like, stop talking so mm -hmm. much. My mom's advice was, oh, well I would do it without the alcohol. I remember the other day when I was like, I just want to take this much of my ponytail and just cut it off with scissors. And that's like basically what I did. Um, I mean, I evened it up a little bit, but. Do you feel better about life now? Oh, I do. I'm pretty happy with my haircut. Mm -hmm. You never know. When you cut your own hair, you never know how it's gonna turn out. Especially yeah. when you're not an experienced hairdresser, you're just some crazy lady who's cut her own hair. <laughs> I got some really good stuff this week, and I can tell by looking on your side of the desk that you got some really good stuff. I'm trying She's not cheating. to look, though. She's cheating. <gasps> Stop peeking. <laughs> I got the replica by the fireplace perfume. It's a 3.4 ounce bottle, but I'm still afraid. Like I don't want to run out. I've been running on samples of this for like six months. This is a love it or hate it kind of smell. I, I don't think it would smell good on me, but I well, like it on you. Well, thing when I first got the sample, I was like, am I gonna wear this like right. as perfume? But like I can't stop myself now. It smells so good. It smells it's like, like campfire, campfire, but like kind of sweet. Because something I didn't realize it had chestnut in it. I just yeah, thought it was like campfire burning wood and chestnut are the top notes. I, I put it on like six times a day. Mm -hmm. I probably am like. One of those cr like crazy perfume ladies right now. You know when someone walks in a room and you're like, oh, whoa, what are you doing? Sorry, no, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Yay! This is Urban Decay Naked Ultimate Basics. And I've tried it the last couple days. Uh -huh. I love this. I really want it. I'll show them. Wait. Can you see it? Oh, 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 oh. 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 oh out of focus. Yay! Yay! They're buttery and. <laughs> blendable and amazing. Yeah, I love it. I'm an Urban Decay eyeshadow girl. Obviously, you know that about I me. mean. Oh my gosh, here I am like tapping things on the desk again. Love. Jealous. We're right, We're right here. here. Shape Tape Yay. was finally back in stock. I feel like this and the Urban Decay yes. and the um, Too Faced Born This Way concealer are all really good. I don't feel like this is just so much better than them. You get a little too much yeah. And it's hard to get like right here for me. I don't like dislike the applicator. It just, I was expecting it to be like, this is the best. And you know, it's fine. It's so high coverage that you have to like there's scrape too, it all off. Yeah, like there's too much on the yeah, applicator it's, for how little you need. Right. Yeah. I definitely think that this can't replace all other concealers. Um, what this, would you need? What do you mean, like, why would you only need one concealer? Why even try to replace all your other makeup? You need all of them. Oh, I thought you were arguing with me. And no, I was I'm like, like, why would you? No, do you because. Mean, why would you need one concealer? No, because I think. Because you need all of them. Well, yeah. Uh, here's the problem with these drinks. They're gone. They're gone. Let's get another one then. You want to say it? Hold, please. Oh, I made them bigger. Cheers. And they're so pretty. Mm -hmm. You, me, me, you. I don't. I don't remember. Uh, me. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. you! You got so much good stuff this week. Uh, I've been basically loving Urban Decay since uh -huh. 1996. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Like, we're going way back. Way back. Way back. Definitely the first high-end makeup I ever bought was Urban Decay. I love them. This is the Urban Decay Vintage Lipsticks. I got Smog, Roach, and Bruise. 
That's why I gave it to you. I know. <laughs> I must have this. I love brown lipstick. Yeah. Brown metallic lipstick. That's like my jam right there. I need both of these exactly, brown ones. Exactly, right? Once again, Urban Decay. We love you. Hitting it out of the park, Urban Decay. I love this. Mm -hmm. I love this. This is good. This is good. Mm, burp. Saturday, when I went to Ulta, they gave me so many samples. At Ulta? Yeah. I feel like they never do that. I got a really good sized Lancome makeup remover. I got a Shiseido. Was it, gift with, was it like gift with purchase stuff or just like, no. hey, we got some random samples? That doesn't happen very often. And a Shiseido serum, a Shiseido eye cream, a perversion mascara. They just like gave me a ton of shit and I was like, that's weird. Thanks. That's not like Ulta. I'm surprised you're wearing that one. Why? Because it's like my kind of a blush. Oh, I know. Because I'm pink today. I'm wearing pink. I'm wearing pink. Doesn't happen very often. Any more shopping stuff? Boom. Boom. This is, is the tartest. I'm okay. sorry. Don't you mean tartiest? Tart. Tartest. It. I don't know. It's um, not that hard. Do you like it? Yes. Have you used it? This is a teeny tiny stick eyeliner. Very pointy. Ooh. Is that the liquid side? Yeah. Yes. That is so black. Yeah, and it lasts so long. The stick liner, you just have to like barely touch it to your skin, it comes off. That's pretty great. I have one more thing. This is a Bobbi Brown, what's it called? Bobbi to Glow Shimmer Break Palette. When I saw this, oh my gosh, so awkward. The gold shimmer brick is the one I've been wanting the most, but they're so expensive. I get paying for certain things and I get paying for certain names. I don't understand these at their price. They're so expensive. I don't, I just don't get it. So what's happening? Hi. Hi. I like when they make limited edition palettes of permanent items. So this isn't like, oh, new colors we made for this Christmas. This is gold, bronze, and wild rose. These are their permanent um, shimmer bricks. I like well, palettes, and then you don't have to buy all the permanent ones like if you want them. And like when if, you, if, you, if you're like us, you feel like you need to like collect everything, you know? And when you so, fall in love with something, you can potentially get it again. What if, heaven forbid, I know, right? this were to fall and break, or you and then were you'd be to like, lose oh, I it, can't get or, it. Yeah. So um, I'm really excited about this. I love it. I'm wearing some of the pink one today. What? We're here. Hi. We're just sitting right, right here. here. Hello. Maybe I should just leave it on faces. This is like really. Oh well, we're learning. Yeah. What the fuck? <sighs> Penelope. Oh, was I? I forgot her name. Penelope. Penelope. Get, Get it together. together. favorite highlighters but um I couldn't decide I just did this 10 favorites I have to is pee that, is that too many okay I'll think about it while you go to the bathroom I have to pee. hold please potty break okay cheers highlighters highlighters okay this one was really hard for me because these are my this is my favorite mm -hmm. like my favorite is highlighters. Not mine. I know, but mine. <laughs> were you as surprised when I said highlighters as were as you were when I said no, lip no, gloss? No, 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 not not as lip gloss. You hate lip gloss. I do hate like lip highlighters. Gloss. You're just like nah, not that. I'm like oh yeah. I don't God. hate highlighters. You hate lip gloss. Yep. Oh, you're going formula. Yeah, because I couldn't pick shades. That would be impossible. <laughs> this Lorac highlighter. It's so good. The Light Source Illuminating Highlighter in Twilight, but I want all of them. It's just so good. It doesn't, like, it wasn't that exciting in the pan, and then I swatched it, I was like, oh, this is cool. And then I put it on, and I was like, whoa. Like, it's so good. Starlight or Moonlight? Those are the ones. I want all of them. Yeah, I am interessante -ed. And then, um, the Let's bomb. Let's cut that out. That's not a word. what do you say? interessante -ed. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> and then um, the Bone Mary Luminizer. Like, everyone knows this. It's the best. Like, it's so 
it's just like a champagne, but like it's for some reason like this one, like if I can't decide or like this goes with everything, like every look I feel like you can wear Mary Luminizer with. It's great. So I don't need to say that much about that. I think I've talked about it before and everybody loves it. This guy? Oh, I love that guy. This is the sleek highlighting palette in Solstice. Oh. That one doesn't open very far. Okay. I like this one a lot, and I'm wearing all of it today. Really? Because I couldn't really choose. I like the purpley one a lot, and I like the yellowy one a lot. It's awesome, and it's affordable, and it's just... Mm -hmm. And it's... The packaging's really dirty. So this is the Urban K After Glow Highlighters. Between the two of us, we have all three. <laughs> I have Fireball and Sin. I'm talking with them over my mouth. I have um, Aura. We can do this now, right? I don't know. Can we? I don't know. Let's try if we do it all. I shouldn't squint and look crazy when I do it, huh? So Sin is champagne-y. Aura is pink. Like icy pink. And then Fireball is the coolest one. It's like peachy with a pink shift. shift. It's very cool. Aura is so shimmery. Look at that fireball. But they're not glittery, which... No, not at all. I don't want my face to be glittery. I like my I, eyes to be glittery, but... I don't mind if my face well, is glittery. Benefit. I love this one. This is Benefit What's Up. Mm -hmm. so. This is so strange to me because it's a peach. Yeah, champagne peach, yeah. It's yeah. so pretty. If they had multiple colors of this, this is not the one I would have picked up. I feel like that is the one I would have picked exactly. up. Exactly. Like my feel, favorite color. Well, highlighter. I feel like this is a Sarah highlighter. It's yeah. not an Eve highlighter. But it's so pretty. So pretty. And the actual formula of this, it's so smooth and soft and blendable. And if you're going to do anything cream-like, that's like the most important thing. I feel like, and I feel like I can put this on over powder. Yeah, and not have it be like some crazy yeah, like, like take all your makeup off or um yeah i feel like i can wear that over powder this is so i can't drink faster this is so much becca these are just a some of the variety of becca things so this is like their regular packaging um this i think is opal <laughs> can't even open it this is opal that's a good one it's moonstone that's okay. the one i want and then I think my favorite is the sh is Champagne Pop. This is Prosecco Pop, the sort of golden one, and then this is Champagne Pop, like the peachy one. I think that's my favorite of the Becca ones. And like it, this palette is not anymore, but they have, sh like Champagne Pop is permanent at Sephora. It's like the right amount of shimmer and not glitter, and they're all really like soft and creamy, and they just look so good on the thing. Those, I can't even talk anymore. Eve, I didn't eat very much. This is hard. Okay, your turn. Do you want the non-alcoholic one? Yeah. I'm gonna drink this. Pour a little bit in here. Okay. Okay. I don't need to talk about this one. No, you should, I wanna talk about this one because I don't have it. This one? Yeah, tell me about it. Okay, I've had this for a really long time. The packaging is broken. What's that? This is Too Faced. <laughs> this is Too Faced Candlelight. <laughs> it seriously has way more glitter than I would ever yeah, like, that no, I normally it is, wear. Like, but it's such tiny, tiny but it's glitter. It's really, it's for being something shimmery and sparkly, it's pretty subtle. Yeah. This is a softly illuminating translucent powder. Uh -huh. So I think the thought is that you could t probably use this all over your face. No. Mm. Oh. 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 It's Frank's birthday. He can bark. Happy birthday, Frank. Happy birthday, Frank. My last one's Anastasia. Glow Kits. I have Gleam. Gleam, I think, might be discontinued. I love that you can take the pans out. That is so smart. Like, why doesn't everyone just be like, make it so you can take the pans out? What's the big deal? Then people could do two things with it. They can leave it in or they can take it out. I can't believe you finished that drink. That was so hard for me to finish. I needed this non-alcoholic one. I feel a little better now. I'm gonna put some more champagne in my drink. I perked up a little. Oh yeah, just kill it. Okay, let's cheers. 
Okay. Uh, thanks for hanging out with us. Thanks. Bye. 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 I'll read you then again. Yeah. I'm gonna that a little bit. <laughs> All right, we did it. I just don't feel like we did it, but maybe that's because, I don't know, I feel like we talked for a long time. We did, we talked so long. Okay, we're done, right? Bye. Bye. <laughs>